everyone, welcome to Discover English Academy video. I'm Yalda and today I want to teach you some fun vocabularies. Okay, so uh, I want to teach you some vocabulary and terms and expressions that uh, so you can use whenever you want to order at the coffee shop. You might think it's not that hard to order a coffee at the coffee shop, but yes it is, especially at Starbucks recently not really recently just like i can say just like uh, from a decade ago um they have their own vocabulary that just like um get into the language right and um so if you don't know that so it's just kind of challenging for you to order what you want at a starbucks i generally talk about how you can order coffee and i can tell you just like some vocabularies that is just like specifically for starbucks but you can use them in another coffee shops if you go there okay um, let's talk about the size first okay the sizes we have of course small medium large but if you go to coffee shop just go to Starbucks so you cannot use these terms right so they have their own terms whenever you want to just like order a coffee so what do you have to say tall actually means small and grande means medium and venti means large okay so whenever you go to the Starbucks or any coffee shop so they understand what you're saying okay so you can use these terms instead of small medium large you can say tall grande venti okay now here so I want to just like talk about um, different kind of drinks that they have so good thing about Starbucks is that so when you go there so you can customize the drink that you want to drink okay but you need to know so how to order it let's say very very common and general drinks that you can drink at Starbucks there are latte so what is latte it's just hot milk plus one or more than one shots of espresso okay cappuccino again it's hot milk plus one or more than one shots of espresso with foam on top and iced coffee is a coffee that just like cool it down add ice on it and it's just like a very good treat for summertime of course and the other one is frappuccino frappuccino usually comes with whipped cream on top whipped cream this is the spelling and uh, so for if you want more espresso in your drink imagine you want to order a latte with more than one shots of espresso so you can say I want double double means double shots of espresso or triple it means three shots of espresso in your drink if you want to just order a regular coffee or drip coffee we have different kinds as well okay so we have blonde which means mild roasted or light pike which means medium roasted or dark or dark roasted okay so this is how they roast the coffee so we have blonde pike and dark blonde is my favorite because it's not that strong but it really depends on you how to choose your drink okay and whenever you want to just like order your coffee and you say for example I want um, tall blonde the barista barista is a person who's making a drink for you making, making coffee at the coffee shop for you okay preparing your drink barista might ask you do you want room it means do you want some room for milk or cream in your coffee and you can say if you like it just black you can say no no room please but if you want to add more milk or cream to your coffee so you can say yes please just some room okay and then so you can add cream or milk to your coffee now here we want to see what kind of milk we have we have some different kind of milk that you can use uh, so we have non-fat non-fat it means no fat at all in the milk 
or low fat, it means very low in fat, whole, which is a uh, normal milk, right? 3.5% um, fat in your milk, and organic, yeah, and soy milk. Whenever you want to just like add one of this, so you can ask barista to add it to your coffee, or it's usually there is a stand next to the, for example, where you order, and you can just like add it to your coffee. Some people, they don't really like, or um, it's not really good for them to drink caffeinated drink. They can always order decaf or decaffeinated. It means no caffeine in their drink. Okay, so you can say, I just want a venti decaf with some room for milk. Okay, so when you drink lots of caffeine, lots of coffee, so you will be over caffeinated so you can say so you feel that for example your heart beat and you don't feel very well so you can say i'm over caffeinated or there is an idiom for that so you can say i'm wired it means too much caffeine in my body now i want to teach you what is the sequence of the words right so whenever you want to order so you can use them for example, so whenever you want to order your drink, these are the order of the actual words that you're using. First, you have to just say the size. Do you want tall or venti or whatever, right? So size, iced, so it's just like optional. So do you want it iced coffee? So you'd say iced or probably no ice or easy ice right it means you want iced coffee but not lots of ice in it no foam which is optional again for example you want to just order cappuccino and you say no please okay decaf i explained that before number of shots for example if you want your latte with double shots so you say double or triple and drink type so it means blonde latte whatever you want Look at the example here. So you can say, I want tall, skim, skim milk, no fat, skim, decaf, double latte, or venti iced coffee. These are the order that you can use if you want to order your drink. When you go to the coffee shop, you will have similar conversations, just like these are the questions you might ask or the barista might ask you, right? So to just like, um, question actually just let, let them know so what you really want for example can I have a large coffee please instead of large when you're at the Starbucks you can say venti okay or um, I'd like a coffee please could I please get a small coffee or tall coffee would you like mild medium or dark it means mild roasted or medium roasted or dark at Starbucks you can say blonde pike or dark which blend would you like it means the same thing right so what, which blend it means do you want mild or dark or medium okay so which blend would you like or how dark do you like your coffee and you can say blonde for example or um, mild coffee do you want the mild blend the other one, so if you don't want caffeinated drink, so you can ask, you can always ask, is it decaffeinated or do you have decaf? Is that decaf? So these are the questions you can ask. When you order your coffee, especially in other coffee shops, right? Um, so they usually ask you, is that for here or to go, right? So it means, so do you want it in a paper cup to go to take it out or so you want to sit here and drink it so at starbucks usually just like i can say most of the time so you just like get it to go even if you just like stay there and drink it but the other coffee shops probably they just like give you in a mug right so you can just say is that for here or to go so they, they want to ask so just like how do you want to drink it so do you want that in a to-go cup paper cup do you want that in a mug right so if you want to just like sit there and drink it probably you can get it in a mug are you staying here 
or is this to go right it means do you want to just like take out your coffee with you outside and whenever you want to get your coffee in a paper cup so don't forget to put sleeve around it because it's usually too hot right and you want to you don't want to burn your hand of course right so don't forget to put sleeve around it okay i hope you really enjoyed this lesson and thank you for watching our video so you can subscribe to our youtube channel and you will be notified whenever we upload a new video thanks for watching again and see you later